Welcome to the video, my friends. Today, we're going to check out the Forspoken demo on PS5. This game looks amazing, but I'll be honest, from the trailer, it looked a bit cringe, so I weren't really that interested. Without waffling on, let's jump into the game and see what it's like. I believe this is also the first proper PS5 exclusive, so it's not PS4, PS5 cross-gen type thing. So far, it's not surprised me or shocked me with how good it looks. It's, it's no better looking than, say, Horizon Forbidden West. Yep, let's begin the tutorial, I guess. I guess this starts a little bit later on in the game, maybe. Oh, magical parkour if we hold circle. Oh, lots of nice little particles. We've got a loot below item here from killing that dude. It's not much, but you never know. What the hell was that voice there? I see it seemed a bit out of place. Okay, the attacks are pretty nice. Particles are nice. Got you on your toes now. Don't feel like it's running too great. Feels like it's maybe 30 FPS. Wait, is that our magical cuff talking to us? It did say it was sentient in the intro, so. A little bit weird. Okay, that's the yeah, other. I like that attack. It's pretty cool. Time for my favorite. Well, were these deers coming to kill me? What's going on? Why are deers attacking me? Oh, hold on. I totally missed at the bottom there, hidden away. L1 and R1 to change settings. So there is display settings here. Uh, what have we got? Motion blur off. And image quality settings here. Choose your preferred display mode. Quality standard setting that focuses on achieving a stable frame rate of 4K. Ray trace enables ray tracing, offering beautiful graphically enhanced visuals. And performance focus, lower resolution in order to achieve higher frame rates. Let's try the ray trace setting and see if the game looks uh, different. See if it looks better. Let's get into some trouble on this bridge, I guess. Oh, what's this? You can use magic parkour to dodge enemy attacks in the battle. Yep, I've been I've been doing that. Oh, uh, pretty much already. Oh, okay. I sometimes wonder how come a little guy like you makes such a good shield. You're good, right? I wouldn't say good exactly. Ready? We can make a shield with that attack. Okay. All right. Oh, nice area of effect there, but he got me with that ice attack. What a way to finish. Oh, who's this? Locking onto enemies. Oh, yep, I've been doing that already. That's not doing much. Look out. Two 
soon. You think? Yeah. Nope, not working. Yeah, we are doing some damage. Got him. First try. Ray's magical powers have increased. I think that's that. it damn well it's very particle-y. There's particles everywhere. Yes. Well done. It's not much, but you never know. Gather all the resources. Not sure why those deers are hostile. I'm sure there's some story behind it. I'm going to pick some flowers here. Apparently, I'm still in danger. Oh, now I'm safe. Okay. Oh, I'm in danger again. What the heck? Hello? Whoa, I got some fiery sword I didn't even realize I had. Okay, that's much better. I like the fiery sword. Come on. You're fucking kidding me. Learn to take your time. The gameplay is growing on me. I'll give it that. The gameplay is growing on me a bit. I'm not particularly seeing any standout-ish ray tracing things, though. I was I was hoping we'd come across some kind of water, a river, a lake, or something like that to see some reflections, but... That's a pretty big area for a demo. You can explore this whole area. Can I jump off and use parkour and not die? Turns out I can. It just shatters my shields. At least we got some water here. Let's see if we actually got ray trace reflections. No, it's screen space. Oh, that's the first time I've seen an assassination thing. That's pretty cool. Oh, that seemed to be a collectible. So that's what I was hearing. Well, we just jump in here. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, there's some big creatures. Big crocodiles. Break. Not enough to be a problem, at least. Not for you, anyway. People used to live here. People who may have left valuables behind. Hmm. Might as well take a look around, I guess. The parkour system's a little bit weird. You can't... It's not like parkour. You can just press and hold over the walls there. I had real trouble getting over that wall there. Well, we can paint our nails to do different spell damage and attack spell charge more quickly. Different traits. Okay, that's uh, interesting. Oh, I'll paint my nails like this. Hey, I'm always... Then we can loot this little chest. All's well there. Shit. Looks like some kind of lock. Oh, wait, it's locked? Oh, we got a little puzzle. Okay. Um. Yeah, so all in gameplay is not too bad. The magical parkour system's a little bit clunky. It's called parkour, but when it comes to like doing that, it did not work over a small wall, and I kind of had to press jump before the parkour would kick in. It's working okay now, so maybe it was just at that moment it had a bit of a moment. Pretty sure I'm running over water as well here. Wait a minute. That's not my last mission, is it? That's going to kill me.
Okay. Right? Wanna try and take this fucker down? What is it? Immune to tangled, prison, confused, stopped. Ah, okay, this is gonna be uh... I don't mind. Keeps me on my toes. That's it. Nope, not working. Ready? She keeps saying it's not working, she said that a hell of a lot, and it's working, so. Um, I died. That's that. Well, we just used our iPhone to take a picture. Yeah, we're probably. I think we're missing a lot of uh, What's this? the start of the game in this demo. Probably make a lot more sense then. But they talk a lot. These characters keeps chiming in and saying things that don't really make sense. Like I'm damaging this boss. But she's saying we're not doing anything, but his bar's going down, so just pointless chatter. See if I can use my soul skills on this. Get them dodges on point. Yeah. That's not doing much. Well, do something. Um, I pressed Y. Oh my god, I pressed triangle to kill the bloody dragon and she opened a chest that was right next to him. No. That window is so tiny, and if you've dodged out the way, you're way too far to finish off the attack. This boss. This first boss fight is more frustrating than anything already. gonna cheese him i'm just gonna get in his side and then hope that pops up and then i can do it okay that's so annoying though i'm just spamming it right now this seems to be working better than 
playing it how you think you've got to play it. I'm just getting in there and hitting him. We're cheesing him big time. Spamming this sword. His hits aren't hitting me now because I'm so close to him. And we got him. Okay. I kind of broke the game on the demo on the first big boss. So uh, that's the thing. Thank you for playing. But if the rest of the bosses are like that, that's going to be poo. Gameplay was okay till that boss. It looks okay. Not sure what the ray tracing did, but oh, oh, oh here we go. Like I said, I think it's a PS5 exclusive, not cross-gen with PS4. Doesn't really look... I can't see anything that really looks better than Forbidden West, other than all the little particles. That Dragon Boss put me off. I don't think I'll be buying it just off that boss impression. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Have you tried the demo? If not, what do you think of the gameplay you just saw? Mm. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to see more of the videos I create. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you peeps next time.